Hi, my name is Olivia Murphy Walkanish. I am a senior from Boulder, Colorado, and I'm studying psychology and philosophy. Psychology is just something that stuck out as something that interests me. Um, and so I figured if I'm gonna be in school, I might as well pick something that interests me and it'll allow me to be in school and pursue other things. Olivia's involved in orientation. She has been from the beginning as a student, then she became an orientation coordinator. She became an orientation color lead and an orientation coordinator. She's involved in honors and was on the um, student advisory board. She works at the library. She is involved in Student Government Association. She was um, the president of Omicron Delta Kappa. And um, she's in choir and she's um, singing and music is one of her passions. She's um, exceptionally bright and committed to studies, but and she loves music. She's not a music major, but she's been involved in choir since she was a freshman and she loves to sing. She has a beautiful voice. Sarah, above anybody else here at Western, knows me the best. She sees me day in and day out, but then also in some of my bigger pursuits and things that I have done here at Western. Everything from the Sweetheart Ball, through student government, through helping in some of my huge days of service in ODK, all the way up through being one of the orientation coordinators this past summer. She's, she's seen it all. She's been there through all of it. So... Before I even started my journey as a student here at Western, I was on one of the wilderness based orientation groups. My last day of that trip, I was hiking, or no, I was climbing in Taylor Canyon when a 20 pound rock fell on me and fractured six of my ribs, um, and my spine in two places, and punctured a lung. So uh, I was a helicopter to Denver and I missed all of orientation, which meant that I had to meet with Sarah Phillips upon returning to Western, and she got me settled in um, and connecting me with resources all across campus. I got to meet some of the previous orientation leaders and I found myself really connected really quickly with the lead program and the orientation program. So when applications opened up the following, um, I guess it would be the spring, I was able to apply and I became an orientation leader, which led me into working for lead and then doing orientation again and again. And through the whole process, I got to work alongside Sarah Phillips. So for my very first day at Western and through the past four years of my experience, I've been seeing Sarah day in and day out. It was obvious to recommend Olivia for the award. The thing that stands out for me the most is her commitment towards inclusion and making Western a place for everyone. I think it's one thing to be really busy and involved with a lot of things and it's another thing to be involved and actually put your heart into it and put your time and energy into it. It's so it's not that you're involved to have it on a resume per se, but you're involved because it's what you care about. And that's something I've really admired about Sarah and something that I have tried to take on as well. That yes, you can be involved in a lot of things, but make sure that you're doing it from your heart. Olivia's taught me a lot. First and foremost, she reminds us all to put people first. Work can't happen if people aren't feeling included and um, a part of something greater. And so um, put energy towards that, even if it takes a little bit longer, and then the, the next steps easily follow. Olivia's awesome. She's fun. She's graceful. She's eloquent. She's kind. She's... I mean, she's the best. <laughs> Sarah, thank you for believing in me and giving me the tools to do everything that I wanted to do. I've had some pretty interesting and ambitious ideas from the pheromone party to making a five day event, an online event through social media. And no, no matter what I'm doing, you've always believed in me and treated me like an equal, which is something I really value. You never saw me as just a student or somebody who's learning or maybe not as capable. You believed in me and, and gave me the freedom to run and try whatever I wanted to do. So for that, I am forever thankful. So it is a huge honor to be recognized, um, but I also want to make sure that the people who got me here, such as my family and all my other supporters are also recognized too. It's kind of like a, a team award instead of just a me award.